welcome back to the channel. And this is the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 5. Now you're probably watching this because you either already have the Fold 5 and you're looking for accessories to buy, or you're in the market for a Fold 5 and you wanna know what some of the accessories that are out there. Uh, now these are my curated items and items that I bought personally. So starting off with the first item, let's talk about the Samsung S Pen case. Now the beautiful thing about this official Samsung S Pen case is that one, this is a first party case, so the fit and the finish is unmatched. Uh, it's super slim, yet it comes with the new S Pen for the Z Fold 5. Now you can technically just buy the S Pen on its own for around $50 or so, but without a place to store it, the S Pen case with the actual pen makes the most sense if you're into jotting down notes using an actual pen. It is a bit pricey for a case, but like I said, the fit and the finish is unmatched. And the only thing that I wish Samsung had for the S Pen case is more color combos. There's only three that you can pick from, which is this black one that I have. There's also a blue one with a green S Pen, and there's also one in gray with a peach S Pen. Now, the second one on our list is the Taurus MagSafe case plus S Pen holder. Now, this is the case that I've been eyeing for a while ever since I got my hands on the Z Fold 5. As someone who enjoys having MagSafe on all my phones for charging, since I have so many docks or MagSafe chargers all around the house, I wanted to have that MagSafe experience for my Z Fold 5. So Taurus, at least at the time of making this video, is the only case maker that has a solid MagSafe case. Now, unfortunately, there's some drawbacks, but first, the case itself is awesome. It has a frosted back with a nice soft matte finish, and you can see the circular magnet there for MagSafe, and it works great. The fit and the finish is awesome, but the big drawback here is that Taurus doesn't offer this case without an S Pen holder. So if you have a Z Fold 5 and you didn't buy the S Pen on its own or you bought the, uh, the S Pen case, what you get is a front case with a flap sticking out for you to put your S Pen in. And if you don't have an S Pen, uh, it's kind of just there. And as of right now, it doesn't support the S Pen that actually came with the case. I'm not exactly sure whether the standalone S Pen is different from the one that I have, or if this one fits the uh, older Z Fold 4 S Pen, but at least the version that I have doesn't fit in this case. But hopefully they also start selling one without an S Pen holder to keep the case as minimal as possible while still having access to MagSafe. Now, if you're not a huge case person, and I'm typically not either, you might wanna check out my friends at dbrand. Dbrand, if you guys didn't know, produces some really cool vinyl skins for your phones to not only give your tech products a super unique look, but also helps protect your phone from scratches. Now, dbrand makes the best and most precise skins in the world, and their palette line is the perfect skin for the Z Fold 5. Unfortunately, I got the Phantom Black color for my Z Fold 5, so what I did was apply their Seabreeze skin on the back of my Z Fold 5, and boom, it looks so much better, and there's no additional bulk. Now, if you guys wanna check out dbrand, make sure to go to dbrand.com slash heymarkel or click the first link down below, and huge shout out to dbrand for sponsoring a portion of this video. All right, so most phones these days don't ship with an actual charging brick, and if you don't own any fast chargers yet, you may wanna check out this 45 watt charger from Ugreen. It's a dual USB-C port charger that can fast charge your Z Fold 5 at its highest 25 watt charging speed, but you can also plug in another device at 20 watts without slowing down your phone's charging. It's pretty affordable and you can sometimes find this charger on Amazon hovering around $25, and that's a really good deal. So if you're not a case person and let's say you still want MagSafe on your Z Fold 5 and all you want is a dbrand skin, but you also want MagSafe, I found this really thin MagSafe sticker that you can stick on the back of your phone and will basically give you, you know, those MagSafe capabilities. And what I love about this specific one though is that it's thin. It's about two millimeters thin and it comes with a guide to help you place it on your phone. And all you do is find the right spot where it you know, needs to be and it can wirelessly charge your phone like MagSafe. Now this and the next item in my opinion is pretty critical nowadays. This is an expensive phone and you wanna make sure that this phone is in mint condition uh, in the next couple of years. The front display on the phone is quite prone to scratches so what you should do right away is pick up a screen protector from Spigen. They're fairly affordable hovering at around 15 to $20 and it comes with two glass protectors and an installer. So it's pretty much perfect all the time. But yeah, this is just your basic screen protector. It's clear, it has an oleophobic coating so fingerprints won't show up as much. But the next thing that I wanna show you is a screen protector perfect for those who commute or travel a lot, and if you travel as much as I do, this is a must. 
This is a glass privacy screen protector from Whitestone for the Z Fold 5. And just like the Spigen one, it also comes with an installer and all the necessary things to help you get the perfect install. And it's a really good protector in my opinion. If you look at it from the left and right side, it'll go dark. And this is perfect for those who always commutes and uh, wants their privacy when using their phone. It's priced about the same as the normal glass screen protector, but one thing I will say about these privacy screen protectors is that clarity will go down a bit. If you stare at the screen really close or long enough, you'll definitely notice some grain or haziness. So if you want extreme clarity, you may wanna opt in for the normal screen protector. But if you don't really care about that, this is not a bad option. One thing I love about the Fold is playing games on this bigger inner display. Now, I wouldn't say that this next item is necessary, but if you're a gamer like me and you're getting into emulators and whatnot, then this Bluetooth controller is perfect for the Z Fold 5. So this is the RIG MGX Pro controller, and it's basically an Xbox controller with a holder in the middle for your Z Fold 5. It works via Bluetooth and when I'm playing games on my phone, the input lag, even though it's Bluetooth, is not noticeable at all. The grip reminds me of an Xbox controller. Uh, the buttons are clicky and the analog sticks are clickable. The shoulder buttons could be better, but they work just fine. And this thing can last up to 20 hours on a single charge and charges via USB-C. So if you wanna take advantage of that big screen and you want to game on the go, this is probably the best option for the Z Fold 5. Now, I wouldn't recommend USB-C controllers since your phone's gonna look awkward with the other half of the screen is below your controller. So I would just recommend getting a Bluetooth controller like this. But yeah, those are my favorite or top picks for the Z Fold 5. If you have anything else to add to the list, leave them in the comments down below. Thank you all so much for watching and yeah, I'll see you all in the next one.